Hi, hello, my name is Jade and welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome if you're new. Today's video is just kind of a laundry day and then I am going to talk about my husband's reenlistment ceremony in the middle. So I hope you find this video motivating and you do your laundry too if you have to because sometimes I need some motivation too. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. these pills so much. Did it. All right. So we started our laundry, we took our pills and we made our coffee. Let's So, I just kind of want to talk a little bit because, I don't know, I haven't talked to you and like, I didn't talk yesterday, but I talked the day before. Uh, yesterday was my husband's reenlistment and it was pretty cool. I was so happy to be there. I was so excited to be able to support him. It was kind of a lot because there was a lot of people that I didn't know there. I know quite a few of his coworkers. But most of them are on a different shift than what he is right now. And um, his good friends weren't able to be there because it was scheduled earlier than what it was supposed to be. So it was kind of sad because I didn't get to see them. And I was nerve-wracking because I didn't know all these people. But it was still really cool to be there and get to see him re-enlist. Because we weren't dating when he first joined the military. 
and I wasn't able to see him re-enlist back in 2020. Well, not in person. I got to see the video. We were dating, but I didn't get to see it in person. I was working, and I was also in Oregon, and he's in California, so yeah, that was really cool. I was super happy to be there, and I was recording it. I won't show it because, you know, that's just something I'm not going to post here, and all of a sudden, they start reading something off, and then they say my name, and I just like, I was sitting there recording, and then my phone just went. And then my husband was standing up there with the guy that was re-enlisting him, and he goes, your face was like, disgusted and horror mixed. And I was like, because I didn't know what was going on. Like, <laughs> I was so nervous and scared, because there's just a bunch, there's a small room which is a bunch of people all around, teeny tiny, just a bunch of people over here. Like I was standing next to people. There was one person right next, not next to me, cause there was a girl right here. And then like right over there was someone I knew, but like just people here, people here. And it was just like people I didn't know. And like, I don't know if most of you know, but uh, spouses, like people married to military members are called dependas and most of, us are looked down upon because just because some of us like to say that our husband's rank is our rank and that is not the type of person that I am and so I like to just separate myself from you know everything but I do like to support him so I will do a lot to like show him my support and I will you know I like to I like to show him my support and I like to show people what it's like to be married to someone in the military, but I like, I don't want to be considered a dependent. So when they started reading that off, I was like, what is going on? Like I got scared, but like, it was pretty cool. I was really happy to be there for him. And yeah, I, I'm just happy for him. I'm happy that he got to do that. And yeah. The first time he got a pen and this time he got a challenge coin so that was really cool and he was really nervous <laughs> and after we went to our favorite uh, restaurant which is black bear diner which is super cool and then we had to go find some thread because he's going to get his wings today um i don't know how to explain that because i don't really know what it is but like he had to take a test and do an interview and stuff to get that like he did that over six months ago And he was supposed to get pinned for that so long ago, but they just keep forgetting I guess at one point they lost his paperwork. So it's been over six months So he's gonna get that and then he'll finally get to sew the patch onto his uniform So we had to get the thread for that yesterday And yeah, that was pretty exciting I was kind of hoping that they were going to do it yesterday because they were talking, like, a bunch of people in the, in the shop were telling him that they were probably going to do it, and I kind of wanted to see it. And I guess he's getting another award for something else, and I kind of wanted to see him get that too. Just because I've never been able to see that kind of stuff, and I wanted, I want, I want to see what it's like, but that's okay. So yeah, that was pretty cool, and I'm, yeah. I don't know. I don't know what else to say other than I'm really like excited that I got to see that and happy for him and excited to see what the next four years is going to bring us because that's what he re-enlisted for. Four more years. Four more years.
that's it for laundry day and talking about reenlistment. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. And I hope you, I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.